Here it is, everybody. Oh my goodness, it is Monday, May the 13th, my favorite day of the year. I don't care how old I get, I freaking love my birthday. Does anything really happen on this day? Not really, but I appreciate every second. And because I'm turning a whole new decade, um, I decided to tape myself on the very last night of my 50s. And um, yeah, and then I had a client reach out as my client for today. And she said, like, can you come tomorrow? But I'm like book solid all week. So I was like, uh, can I just come next week? Because I go weekly. And she was like, absolutely. And happy birthday. So yeah, I got the day off. So today my plan is, I'm looking at my little cake plate. And hopefully, because the town is still, I'm so sorry, Stratford. People who say it's a city, it just makes me laugh. The town um, has this beautiful little cake shop, and I hope it's open today because I would love to put my fancy little cake in my cake plate and then eat it. Well, not all of it all at once because it's a little rich. Um, but plan B, if it's not open today, I will continue the birthday process throughout the days of May and um, I will get that cake and the little meringues because they're so pretty and yes I'm going to eat them and I feel fantastic about it. So how do I feel turning 60 you may ask? Well I feel exactly the same as 59. <laughs> it's like people who are getting married and they're like oh my god my life's gonna be so great once I get married. It's still the same life but then you have that other person to deal with. So, nope, just me. My little solitude, way of life. Um, it will change eventually. But in the meantime, I'm appreciating every second of this world. Even though when somebody's in it, I'll appreciate every second of that world as well. Um, because you just need to appreciate every moment of every day. That's all we have. All we have is right now. Tomorrow never comes. Yesterday is just, you know, a little memory. And, um, yeah. So, right now, I'm just so grateful to have hit the ripe old age of 60. As I look at the video, that's still me at 59. And, um, yeah, what am I going to do? Well, it was pouring in the middle of the night. I actually was awake from 4 to 4.30-ish. So I got up 7.30. Um, had a phone call from my son. I usually wake my mom up, and then I looked at the phone because the phone's on silent. And I looked, and then the phone kept ringing back. And I was like, what? And then it was my son. So he wanted to wish me happy birthday. It was so nice. And then he was talking about things he wanted to do or send me, you know. And I was like, you know what? Don't even bother. Like, you know. And my mom was like saying things to me last night about plans and this and that. And I just said, you know what? I just don't care about people. Like she tells me about people who are no longer in my life. And I was like, you know what? Why are you even telling me? Like, I don't care. Isn't that weird? Maybe it's like a 60 thing in the 60s. Ooh, maybe I'm going to dress all 60s this decade. Wow, that would be fantastic because I love the 60s and how people dressed. Oh, and then in my 70s, maybe I'll dress 70s. God, what is wrong with me? My brain's so like, oh, most people are like, oh, my God, I'm going to be 60. And then I'm going to be 70. If we're lucky, we're going to be 80. And then even luckier, we're going to be 90. So appreciate it. If there's something you don't like about your life, change it. I'm telling you the lessons that I learned, people, in my 50s. And you know what? When you look back at your life and I'm thinking, I still don't feel like a grown-up. 
<laughs> like, what is a grown up? I still feel young, like childlike, like a kid. I like to play. I like to have fun. And I think that should be normal. When we really, when you look back at grown ups, they were so serious with all their things and they had to keep all these balls juggling in the air to keep everything. And you know what? I don't have anything really other than a bunch of stuff I make and or go to the thrift store and find, oh, that reminds me of my black shoes I've never worn. I'm going to, um, there will be a continuation on um, of this video of my birthday and I'm going to put all my outfits on that I haven't done for spring because I've been so darn busy which I really appreciate that as well. But I did have the weekend off. I went to a client on Wednesday, and they're my little twins. And one of the twins wasn't feeling well. And it was so funny because, not for her, but for me to look at her all sleepy on this couch. And then she would grab a tissue. She's four. And then she would dab her little nose and then this tissue would go flying into the air. And so she had like <laughs> all these Kleenexes around her that only had like one little dab of whatever on them. And yeah, the way they would just fly so dramatically through the air, uh, it was like the best. But anyway, it took me until Sunday to clue in a little bit why I wasn't feeling so great. And then I was like, oh my God, <laughs> I got sick from her. This is how I feel. I should do that dramatic little, you know, scene. I actually thought about it on the weekend, but I was like, ah, just never get around to it. So anyway, today, what am I going to do? What am I going to do? I'm going to go out. Um, yeah, going to look for my cake. Going to go for a walk through the town. Uh, I'm going to buy myself something. What am I going to buy? I don't know. We'll see. Um, I'm really trying not to buy too many things this month because I buy a lot of things. Ooh, I'm going to work on a shirt pattern that I haven't had time to do, so I'm pretty excited about that for someone special. Um, she wants these tops. Um, what else? Um, I'm going to organize my car. Yeah, and I'm going to let you know that there's one thing that I did purchase online. It's my bike helmet, and it's not your average bike helmet. I didn't want one of the weird things that go on the top of your head. Like, I'm sorry. I hope I didn't insult anyone who has one. But I got me an e-bike, sort of like the French, you know, it's like a half thing, like on top of your head, like, I don't know, with a little brim. Is it a broom? Yeah. Um, and yeah, bought that online, but it won't, it won't arrive until it said the 16th, but now it says the 23rd, which is also full moon. All of you that want to charge your water with the moon energy. Yeah. That's in another video if you want to watch that. So, um, I'm going to wait to get my bike. It's in a storage container um, until I have my helmet. I already have my lock and I'm going to get a little basket. So yeah, lots of plans coming. And uh, yeah, so anyway, I'm just babbling on nine minutes. Oh my God, nine minutes of your life again. But it is my birthday, so... This one's warranted if you happen to tap on and watch this video. So anyway, I'm going to go. I'm going to continue to work on my little blanket. I've already looked at my schedule. I've already written in my journal. And um, then I've done a little bit of crocheting because it's like a meditation and have these beautiful messages coming in. Oh my God, thank you. I'm gonna look later um, at the ones online because um, I it's just like going down the rabbit hole. So I'm just gonna stay present 
and I'm going to just deal with my life here and people in front of me. Um, yeah, that's my goal for the day. I love you all. So I will be shooting video number two, which will have my outfits because I want to wear something nice when I go out today. Anyway, I love you. Sun is shining. Enjoy my day, my birthday. I freaking love it. Love, love, love my birthday. So yeah, please enjoy it with me. Go out and have a drink. And um, yeah, we'll see what this what this beautiful year will bring. Super exciting. And uh, yeah, I can't believe I'm friggin' 60. Oh my God, I think it just hit me. Just hit me. No, I'm just kidding. I love it. I love being 60. Okay? So, oh yeah, and this one's for my dad as well because my dad never got the opportunity um, to turn this age. So, this one's for you, Dad. Um, anyway, I love you all. Have wonderful birthday kisses. And um, I'll chat with you later. Okay, thanks for listening. Please like and subscribe. That'll actually really make my birthday. I'm almost at 300 subscribers. So I just need three more. Could be more if somebody drops off. But anyway, I love you all. Have a great day. Okay, bye.